everybody, I'm Manny. Welcome back to my channel, Self Health Shave. So we're here back for another shaving video. And what are we using today? If you can already tell by the intro, as always, uh, we're using this lavender soap. Um, don't know how, how to pronounce it. Um, yeah, uh, good luck on that. <laughs> Let's just call it a lavender uh, soap. Uh, and here is the back of the label. Now I'm gonna try my best to harvest these stickers um, without uh, damaging them so I can take pictures with them afterward. Um, now you can tell by the, um, the I don't wanna do a parchment paper, um, the cooking paper, whatever you wanna call it. Um, it looks like familiar to another soap uh, from uh, McCurr where the uh, paper was saturated with the oil so I don't, I don't know if I'm going to get any scent from this, but I uh, want to try this to see what we get from it. So uh, I'm going to try to take this uh, this label off uh, in just a minute, and then I'll, I'll pause and get off camera because I don't know if I can do it on camera. We're going to go on with this um, aftershave bomb today, and this is King Luis from Razor Rock. And uh, I've noticed that this one here, uh, this Nevia Man, um, it's got this, I, I can't remember the scent profile, it's like a like a woodsy oud or something uh, i can't remember if i remember uh, i'll post it up on the screen here but this goes really good with a lavender scent um, it really does complement the lavender um, and i really do appreciate it uh, give me a sec i have something on my finger here um and I'm gonna go on with the sterling bore for today's shave. Give me something simple. And I'm gonna go on with the um, supply razor uh, with whatever main uses are on that blade. Um, and I don't remember if I threw the old blade away or if I didn't. And I hope that I did because I do not remember but uh, meanwhile, let me go ahead and try to pull this label off on camera if I can do that. Um, I'm hoping I can do it because it's going to suck if the label gets destroyed. Normally, you would, I would probably do take a picture first, but because I don't know if I'm going to be going out uh, today, going, out, going back out on the road. Um, I don't want to take too much time and pulling out of my pulling all of my gear out to take um, my photos. It's gonna take a bit. It looks like it's coming off nicely. I don't believe it's gonna go back on. Uh, it doesn't feel like there's any more glue on it. Yeah, it's coming off. So how are you all been? I hope you all are well. And uh, hope your 2021 is kicking off uh, the way you plan. Going in the positive and not in the negative way. Um, put this off to the side so I don't ruin that. Because I don't know if any of this is waterproof. So, same kind of way that the, um, that your uh, Mitchell's bull fat comes. So, give it a whiff. There's still some scent. It does have a date on here that says 24-11-16. So, quite an old puck. But, we've all got old soaps in our den. That still smell great. So, we'll see how this goes. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm almost positive these are all the oils, so you guys can see that there. Um, don't know if it's coming up on camera or not, but there you have it. These could be all the valuable oils that would have given it give, given it a scent. So I'm going to put this off to the side so I don't ruin it. I'll be right back. Alright, so we're just going to be palm lathering. I'm going to go ahead and load my razor. Oh, actually, yeah, it is loaded. Damn it, I forgot to take the blade out. 
So, ooh, okay, that could have been a disaster. Gonna put the blade off to the side over here. But yeah, there's already a blade in there. I had to throw the other blade away because I didn't know if I threw it away or not, but apparently I didn't and uh, the blade's already loaded. So let's go ahead and uh, what are we doing here? Um, let's go ahead and just put a little water on my face. Turn back the goatee before I got on camera. It was getting out of control. Alrighty then. I like to have my um, palm leather hand dry so I can grip the puck. Okay, so let's go ahead and get to loading. Here we go. Yeah, so uh, a lot of these products were sent from a friend of mine. A lot of these lavender scents and uh, he has contributed to the channel quite a bit so brother you know who you are thank you very much and uh, this soap is lathering up quite easily don't know anything about this soap. a lot of the soaps that uh, my buddy sent I don't have too much idea or history on them a lot of you guys will see um or have heard of have seen or heard of uh but this one here i've never heard of it don't know anything about the soap i doubt it's a triple milled i might be wrong i doubt it's a triple mill though my buddy uses me as a guinea pig quite often <laughs> and i don't mind it Yeah, just gonna do a really simple DFS shave. Uh, I had a shave the other day where I was rushing. I thought I, I thought I had enough time, and uh, I saw that the, the time was wrong. Well, not the time. My my time was off. Sorry, and um, I, tried, I rushed to get a shave in and kind of had a really bad shave. So. Not kind of had a really bad shave at the helm. I had a bad shave. But yeah, it's lathering up quite nice, quite nicely. So don't know if it's gonna dissipate. Don't know if I'm gonna have a reaction. Don't know nothing about this soap. So I'm gonna go with that there. Yeah, so I was saying um had a bad shave. Um, and I don't want to irritate my face any more than it already has been. I've got, uh, three days of growth, but I can still feel the areas where, uh, I had, uh, some skin irritation. Gonna rinse off the puck. There you have it. Now the good part about this is um, a lot of the time when you get an old puck like this, you get a lot of the um, you get a lot of the the soap uh, base out of it, like the tallow and everything. And uh, I can't pick any of that up, so that's a plus. It does have a lavender scent, your casual lavender scent. The scent's really light, probably on a scale of one to 10, it's probably about, probably about a three. Don't know if it was at that same scent strength when it was released. Um, I'm 
but for those who don't mind light scents or in fact like light scents because they're going to use a different product afterward just maybe right up your alley However, it does not taste good. <laughs> All right, we'll go with that. First pencil to the Just using really light pressure. So the soap is dissipating a little bit. However, I don't know if it's just a soap that can't take too much water or if it just could be that a lot of the good stuff is still down at the middle. Has worked its way down to the bottom or towards the middle. I don't know. But the slickness is good. Yeah, it's, it's starting to thin out. But anyways, the, sl the soap is slip. It's doing the job that it's meant to do.
Man, I just went at a bad angle right here. I felt that. Yeah, this is uh, starting to dissipate quite a bit. Sorry, I'm quiet because I'm just concentrating. Gotta be careful. Since I had a rough shave, like I mentioned.
I know you're probably thinking this is a three pass, but I'm getting rid of all the very noticeable stubble. If you can hear it still, not it's not DFS and I'm not gonna get it DFS. Or uh it's not BBS and I'm not gonna get it BBS. Don't want it. Um that'll be bad. Just getting away with what I can. I probably should have paused the video, but I forgot, so you guys might get a long video. Where I got myself. It almost feels like there might be a pimple. All right, guys, I'm going to rinse off. I'll be back. All right. Nice. Feels good. Let's see if we get any feedback, which I'm sure I will. But let's see how much feedback we get. Got some feedback there. Now, if you can see, it's not BBS. Listen to this. There's parts of my neck that um, aren't BBS. Because I said I was trying to get as close as I can, getting away with a good shape. Got to clean this up. I missed that. Yeah, you can hear a bunch of feedback or um, not audible feedback um, when I go over with the Allen block because that's telling you that I don't ha I didn't get a BBS shape and I wasn't looking for one. Surprisingly that's uh, actually not too bad. Let me go ahead and clean these lines up. All right, let me rinse this alum, guys. Let me rinse this alum off and I'll be back. Nice shave. That's a nice scent. I like that scent. I wish it was stronger. It might not be a scent for everyone, but 
nice all right and you know what it's got some um it's got some good feel properties to it man um i'm actually that feels good that feels really good it feels really soft um i don't know if this has after uh alcohol in it um hope it does i don't even know if it does or not uh i just i fucked up i forgot i don't know if it has uh alcohol on it i really like alcohol on my splashes but uh it is what it is so i think it does i hope it does oh yeah it does does it yeah I know, I don't think it does. I may have just been feeling the uh, the sensitivity uh, to the ingredients in the in the splash. Um, ah, what a beautiful scent! In fact, I'm gonna go in for another dose. And put it on the on the arms, on the neck, chest. Yeah, that's an awesome scent. I love that soap. If you can get your hands on it, definitely pick it up. Um, I don't believe it's available in the States, though. A buddy of mine brought that back for me. All right, let's get in uh, with the balm. And uh, yeah, again, I love when these two scents come together. Um, any lavender, um, as far as I can tell, um, does really well with this. Um, I don't know if I used this one before, which is why I picked it up. And it kind of comes out like clumpy, but as soon as you uh, mossify it with your hands, heat it up, it uh, it does well. kind of ticky you can tell I'll just brush that out or brush it in sorry yeah what a what a oh, nice nice and I'm gonna throw a little bit more on the top <laughs> Look at it, it reactivated it. Beautiful. Man, that was a good shave. Really, really good shave. All right, so let's do the recap here. We went in with um, this lavender uh, puck. There you have it. Um, and the puck is drying out here. Brush of choice was the sterling board. Fantastic brush, once broken in. Uh, razor of choice was the supply. Um, Second use, third use uh, on that uh, the razor, the blazer that it comes with, 
I think the personas. Um, after she have a choice, um, was a Nivea Men Deep. I think Alex just picked this up, or was it Tony? Um, and they absolutely loved it. I kept recommending it to them, and or or yeah, I kept recommending it to them. But I forgot which one of those guys got it. They really love it, and then went in with the. Um, King Louis bomb. That is my shave, guys. Had a fantastic shave. My face feels good. Um, no irritation. The smell of those combination of the two. Oh man, what a fantastic shave. Um, for a beginner or a newbie, this could very well be a BBS shave. Feels really good. There's some spots on my face, but no worries. Uh, fantastic shave. That is all I got for you guys. I hope you all enjoyed. If you do, please like, favorite, share, subscribe as always, guys. And I will catch you guys on my next shave. Later.